new hot plate and I have copper chloride, one mole I prepared from 7% hydrochloric acid with about 200 millimeters of 3% hydrogen peroxide. As you can see very carefully, that's a stainless steel, stainless steel knife being played with copper. And what I have is uh, I'm heating it and the heating gun, the heat sensor reads 50 degrees. I'm trying to create it and stir it and create a very low temperature with the with the device with the uh, beaker, and I have this plate on top, so any 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 vapors that goes through condenses on it. So it's that it's just lukewarm, and that's all I want it to be at. There are some particles of copper being condensed on the side, but most of it is. Uh, Oh, and it's looking very interesting, looking like a bronze color. Copper chloride with certain steels really looks well. I'll show you what I mean with this hop, with this. What a neat color, isn't that neat? I'm going to pull that out in about two, three minutes from now, or a couple minutes. See, turn off the stirring. Take off this plate. Pull out the knife. Freshly prepared copper. Isn't that cool? Freshly prepared copper plating with just a copper chloride solution. I might put in some more. put the plate on it gives an interesting color it's a quite quick way of making copper copper plane it doesn't work without any electricity